Let's just do it again. Happy best Warcraft gamer in the past six years dominating the scene. But recently, it's not been tip top performance. No, tip top performance. So, in relatively good versus undead, top five orc in the world right now, definitely going into this as the underdog. So much is clear. Nose is heavily correlated with pen size. Not for me, brother. Not for me. Here we go. Does so in? Stand a chance. Can he win a map? That's where we start. But let's not talk about winning the series. Let's say the goal is to win a map. Happy is the only player above 2800 MMR. Phalo! Sweetheart! Thank you very much for the sub. Happy is, I think, the only player above 2700 ELO. Happy won the past three WAL competitions in a row. And so on is just coming back from a little bit of a break. That's the setup. Happy has shown weaknesses, though. Losing maps to Colorful, losing two series to Sock, losing the Doobie Cup. Also losing the Human vs. Undead show match. Losing to Lin in the Doobie group stage. And there were flaws. There were forgotten tier 2 buildings. Forgotten techs. Lots of ghoul losses in the beginning. There is reason for hope. If you're a Soen fan. So what odds would you give so in? 1 to 10? 1 to 5? 1 to 15? Give me a number. 30%? 5%? 5%? Okay. Whoa, what? Can someone slap me in the face because this is Blade Master Mirror Image? So how about these odds now? <laughs> um, I don't think anyone expected this. I don't think Happy expected this. He learned from the best. That's right. Did you have a coaching session with him, Scars? Nice to see you here, buddy. I hope everything is going well. Claw number one. Not bad. I wonder what the thing is. He did play it before, right? I'm very sure he did. In general, I really like this. Like, it can be super strong. Problem is, that takes quite some time. That is some... That is item dependent. And... Happy is getting free level 3. You must be of the opinion that you are creeping faster than your opponent. That's not really the case so far. It's level three though. Happy with the staff. Trying to go and hunt the headhunters. There's no got level 3, but... Yes, so far it's working out. Do 
graveyard isn't delayed. So with illusions, you should be able to go for red spots and Happy is... Did Happy miss him? Because he's at the top. Well, there's nothing to do, really. Oh, but he makes the move across, expecting the red spot, and he's right there. So in took a pit stop at the green. I'm not really sure why. But now, when it counts, he's here. Happy is giving Suen an inch. Can't capitalize on that. Missed opportunity for Suen. Very, very, very good inventory on this plate. Crit 2. Is it normal to get Crit 2 here? <laughs> I mean, it's a Blade Master Mirror Image Headhunter build. Nothing's normal. I feel like he's unsure if he can get level 4. So. Big mana potion for the incoming SH, not bad. And now we're going into the night, the night, the night. No, don't even need it. Um, going into double beast three and tier three. Ah. Problem remains. Uh, there's no dent in Happy's game. This is an arms race. Even when Happy calls uh, Grunt with less than 100 HP, that's right! What a god, dude. What a god. But yeah, Coil Nova, man. All Happy has to do is to play the Coil Nova game. There is no Coil, though. There's also no Wind Fog. Wait a minute! There's no Coil! He can kill the Lich just like that, and that's the way to get level 4. Alright. Alright. Tower's coming up. Shadowhunter level 2. Dark Ranger out. Happy's on his trail, but no Nova. Is it too risky? Oh, so it's working out. It's working out so far. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, but it's working out so far. Liability, no Shadow Hunter 3. <laughs> Limited mana usually. But there's the big mana potion. He can try to contest this. Why we're not coming in after the headhunter? Pure oh, sick heal wave by Stoen and also an extraordinary change. This is um No Alchemist by the way. No Alchemist at all. Gargoyle's coming in now. Um Carefully curious and carefully positive that this might work. But Soen didn't get the red spot and couldn't prevent Happy from going to the turtle. The levels will be crazy. But for now, they aren't. And there's still a red spot at the bottom. Upper right, bottom left. So and make this work. He needs levels as much as Happy does.
items, items, items. All of our items. Group of the Magi. Good intelligence on the Shadow Hunter alongside the uh, mantle. So, what's the next step, Soen? Did you plan this far ahead? Mirror image are nice because it kind of forces you. Like, either you dispel the hex and then you got mirror image, or you dispel the mirror image, but then you have to deal with the hex and don't have the solution to hex. There is a chance, by the way, that someone is just playing a Nuzlocke. <laughs> Randomizer Nuzlocke. With Orc? Solid inventory. I'm happy. How does this change the dynamic against Mass Wyvern if you don't have an Alchemist? Is the question. Put of cunning, more agility, more intelligence. Happy. He didn't even invest into Berserkers. Deto. Late Master plus 15. Let's still get an orb. He wouldn't take the fight. I don't think he's ready yet. He needs more bats. Come in. Another kill. Headhunters are falling for it. Put Soen back to 50. Don't want to five on the blade. Crit three is unlocked. But you can't afford these bad rider loss. Good call by Happy. Taking an air fight now. Barely any support for these wyvern. He needs the heal wave. Gets it. All right. Blade Master has no orb. Maybe he doesn't want an orb because of the mechanic. That you can dispel your own hex. But so and took some big losses. Which is the norm with bad riders, because you want to lose them. Happy with some six six. Last hit to Soen. Ooh, Wyvern are falling very, very fast. The Blade Master's 300 crits. 300 crits, but is that enough? It's basically the fate of this game in the hands of the Blade. Lost heal wave, maybe. Can he portal out? He has to, he has to, or he does not. The one Blade army. Trying to catch up now. One coil away from Nova, away from dying. There's no mana anymore. Reveal. Going for the hell. Oh my god, the crits are insane. The crits are completely insane. It's only destroyers. They're really not that good. We do have an orb. Happy is hunting the SH. Oh, that's the dispel mechanic I was talking about. Another heal wave. That means no more hex. Trying to outmaneuver him here. Can he reach? He has no TP, no invul. But let's go. Maybe, maybe someone should focus more on statues. Happy is obviously far ahead in supply. But there's also a Blade Master level 5. Raider switch now. Why we're not gone? Destroyers are empty though. So we're making the choice to keep with the blade. To speed things up. J 
just get level 5 blade master go level 3 crit just crit yeah just get level 5 against happy dude <laughs> like, that alone should give him an achievement Jack with Raiders. Bats coming in. Couldn't get the kill and the coin is there. One destroyer saved by the bell. Lich again. The prime target. He dies again. Third time. Always the number one target here. But so it is basically playing double Dota. And I really, really, really think you, you should focus the statues. Can't reach anymore. New Wyvern, new heal wave. Literally a game on a knife's edge. SH, Lich, Coil is ready. The backstep just a hair too late. But how do you save the Lich? You're trying to play around the Coil timing. Lich is deleted again and again and again. This blade, by the way. Oh, Hex, the Coil. So sick. He's dispelling a lot of his own Hexes. No TP again. Ants there. Will it bring the victory? Not really. No more mana. You gotta disengage. Coil is up in a bit. He wants the DK so bad. Crit, 260. Not a second end snare. New Raiders are coming in. Kodo 8, Lich exposed, hoping for crit. Where are the big red numbers? Oh my god! Shadow Hunter dies before level 5 though. It's seriously just, just pure hero focus. Happy not going for Invo Potion. He has the resources. And snare! Get him, boy! No way! He blocks himself a little bit. Needs that invul so bad. So bad. Tau portal out. And the DK survives. Blade level 6. What is this game? We are still mining. I don't know if the overlay has an indicator if he can get the hero back from the tavern. He's close. Invul was stolen by BM. Oh, good point, chat. SH back, Blitz back, is there gonna be a dieback? Oh, I didn't pass the info potion. Coil defensively again, seven seconds safety, and there. How many times does this Lich have to die? Coil up. You gotta disengage, there's nothing left really. Oh, that wasn't great, that wasn't great. Happy selling buildings, I think. I truly think it's a gargantuan mistake to not go for the statues. So it has two heroes in the unit in most of the fights. Ring of Region at this point not too helpful anymore. Late start. Happy has some tower phobia against orcs. Don't know if he actually got clarity he's running. White blade storm. Um, it's magic immunity and it's great for base races. I don't think anything, any other spell would help him more. Blade storm is really good. To reach, maybe trying to yoink a destroyer behind the forest. Ay, 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 but Happy is playing the Call Nova game. That must be hella frustrating. For both sides, actually. And so in his donating units. Is this a one-man army? 
Interesting to see that Happy is not expanding at all. Very low on gold. Uh, lumber. No shade either. What a game. Can make the argument that expanding against illusions is really hard. Happy breaking up keep now keeps the 20 supply gap intact. That is such a unique game. When do you ever see a 1113 build? Yeah, that's right. Mikarai. Owen has an idea. That there's gotta be an expo at some point. You could whittle down the undead base FFA style with mirror image and blade storm. Mirror image doesn't work too well because Happy has so many destroyers and it's only level one. And Happy is gonna have a shade soon. But it's probably the best way to go. Can someone even build another base? As we are mined out. No, he can't. Could sell items, but then he's getting rid of his own his one win condition. Um Happy is ultra ready for <laughs> hero focus. Heal potion double in wool. And frost armor. Great addition as well. Happy's making sure. There's no walk base. Lots of raiders, man. Are we seeing Blade Storm? We do. Getting rid of all the ghouls. Level 5. That was a quick way to level 5. And of course, you are not nukeable. He's going for the Lich again. 344 crit. Hex. Oh, can't reach. She was slowed down. And then there's always a coil. There's always a coil. And potions. Of course, coil. Nova. Hex against the DK. Perch again. Soen calls the game GG, but what a fantastic idea by Soen. I sound like a broken record, of course, but... Lin showed it before. You gotta attack the statues. You gotta get rid of that regen. 350 crits almost. And Bladestorm did look good. I don't think many people expected this game to be so close, guys. And happy laying in to the Coil Nova game against the Raiders was sweet. Mass Wyvern were never really a thing, despite the absence of an alchemist. And I guess he was also... He was oftentimes a bit unlucky, dispelling his hex a dozen times. I feel like he desperately needed boots. He had a TP all game. He could have sold and squeezed in the boots. Great game by so and though. Not a bad call, Fidelius. Especially once you have Frost Armor up. Yeah, Orb on Blade is, no pun intended, a double-edged sword. A double-edged orb? There's no edge on the orb. You know what I'm saying. That's the thing with Soen at the moment. He's playing top-class 
quality games. And then just one or two things went wrong. It was the same against 1-0, to zero, to be honest. Where he killed the heroes so, 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 so many times. Warp the spilling frost armor. Yeah, that's right. If it lands, but then you are really depending on RNG. I mean, you are depending on RNG always. Because of crit. I don't hate it, Brosepi, though. I don't hate it, Brosepi. Have you ever seen Happy losing so many, so many liches? I probably did not. All right, game two is up. Here at streaming day 75. Another chance for Soen, otherwise he finds himself in the lower bracket versus Infi. And we get the dream match of Happy and Suck. Soen bottom right. Is it the same build again? Will he bank on the headhunters and especially the mirror images again? Soen is showing another flavor of this matchup, though. Is there a matchup with more possible builds than this one? We've seen Mass Wyvern Tier 2 Expo. We've seen Mass Wyvern Tier 3. We've seen Mass Raiders, of course. We've seen Headhunters. We've seen Double Rex Headhunters. Uh, we've seen one of each kind built by Lin with Torin. Variations with a TC, without a TC, Blade Master Farsia. The only other matchup where that I can think of is human human undead. But in human undead we have more variety on the undead side as well. Farsia this time! Hammer fall! This is the map where Sylvan was most successful, I think. Also focus. With mass air. The DK Goulds! What a surprise, huh? Where's Farsia at? Uh, this is Farsia Rush. Ooh, Ghoul dead immediately and the DK at 50%. So Happy trying to go for some evasion creeping as he was not going for the orange, the green or the greens in the middle. This was already a sidestep, but Soen read him very, very, very well. And that is some terrible damage on Happy Early. Cool down, Scout Echo down. Can't follow up on that though. If the wolf... He's greedy. He could cancel healing twice. Asya grunts, by the way. Not bad. Happy also misses the coil opportunity here. Maybe saves it for the turtle, but the Hydra could have been his. Am I getting hyper happy critical? I mean, if you display perfection, 
for four years straight. Tiny mistakes are noticeable. Ah, yeah, can't see that lasted away. But it's about ghoul damage and DK damage, and that looks promising. Happy got the Ring of Regen, the Fire Lord follow up. Hell yeah, the Lin style. <laughs> oh, hit, didn't hit the mute button. The Lin style looked promising before it completely fell apart. Colorado 1616, thank you for the 37 month, my dude. Good to see you, mate. So, incinerate can be some sick, sick, sick damage. You gotta buy time, though. Time is not of the essence if you're up against that. It's not really about summons with the Fire Lord. It's about buying time, increasing creep speed. Incinerate is a really good damage dealer. And even Soul Burn might buy him some time as a Sidon. Help but feel that someone is wasting some time here. Lots and lots of armor. Does armor protect from incinerate bonus damage? No, right? How does that work? I don't think it. Z Carter, thank you very much for the sub as well. 15 month, much love. No, it doesn't. Okay. Damage types in Warcraft. So it's a bit late with the burrow, but I don't think so. We do have incinerate. We do have a mana potion, which is sweet. Potion and a mana potion, not too bad. Wyvern coming, he goes Raider into Wyvern instead of Wyvern into Raider. And he's getting caught, and of course, with the Fire Lord, you lack healing, and that is clearly noticeable. Happy is getting three kills from this creep jack. And now it's getting increasingly hard to hold this expo. The two Wyvern are so necessary. Three up, full mana destroyer, Nova on the Wyvern, incinerate damage needs to be crazy, 
but the single target damage on Happy is just outstanding. I got little hope, but supply is still even. And the expo starts to run. If someone can hold this somehow, survive this somehow, then he might have a chance. But the burrow is down. He can still produce a lot if he gets the resources in. But he can't. And all hope is lost. Man, these second games today are a bit disappointing, eh? First the Enfi Enfi. Now the so and so in. Happy versus Sock is our winner bracket final for the playoffs, everybody. And this so far was just a bit warm up. Very good Turtle Rock game. Very good Turtle Rock game. But I feel like if you get the Fire Lord out, you need to creep like three big spots in very, very quick succession. And so in was slowed down. Didn't come together. Happy, of course, with a mwah, chef kiss timing. To get the expo done before it even timed like 100 gold or something.